They may be from different timelines, but Wise and Draken are fated to clash. Good day, everybody. Hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. I know I am. Salaviathan here. We are back with some more Eden Zero Season 2 on Episode 10, guys. Oh, man. And this season has been great. But last episode definitely gave us some nice information for sure. We met Amira again, the, the woman from Digitalis that fought Homura, but we really didn't know what organization she was a part of. We met Jin again coming in and um, learning a little bit that uh, that the machine that uh, basically keeps Jack and Joe alive is slowly taking the life force of everybody on the belly all gore, even clean. So that kind of brings Jin onto our side here. Uh, meanwhile, on the flip side we had uh Drak and joe and shiki kind of battling um it's, it looked as though shiki was getting his ass kicked just like before well shiki's close he's close he's not there yet at the true overdrive but it seems as though he's gonna get there during this battle it turns out that with the whole life force being taken away wise realized something and kind of came to back up shiki turns out that somebody that wise loved was killed by Drak and joe and some, two things clicked in his mind even though they're from two different completely different histories Jack and Joe and Wise are always faded to meet man oh it was amazing um, but we're gonna get started with this episode don't forget to like share and subscribe guys turn on notifications down below so you know when I upload next and give me give me your thoughts in the comment section down below of your the season so far I love to hear what you guys like most about it and um, some things that you wish would be a little bit better anyway let's get started with uh, Eden Zero season 2 episode 10 Advent of the Demon King. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, like it looks like he's not doing anything to him. I don't know, man. Our hero is angry right now. Come on, wise a hero of justice needs to control his emotions. Number one. Ah, oh, 60 years ago. Kaosan. stole the life force of Wise's mother? Oh my god, yo, like he was basically torturing the planet. Just taking the life force from everybody. Now I understand his anger. I understand it. Oh my god, man. I just hope. I just hope Wise can get some good licks on him. Shut the fuck up, Jack and Joe. Shut the fuck up, man. You know for very well that you kill people. Selfishly. Man. Damn it, man, I at least wanted him to get like one good hit on him. Just one for his mother. で、その
Huh? Uh, for a second, I was thinking this was our wisest history, but I think this is Super's wisest history. The original one. It's the same shit. The same shit. Oh my god, it was one of his cr rap bastards on his on his crew? You never used to have friends wise, but you got friends now. Hell yeah. Time to team up here, man. I never expected this to be a two on one battle. Reverse that life force energy, man. Make this guy mortal again. Man, I thought he was getting weaker. But it looks like he might be getting even more monstrous. Holy shit! What is that? What has he become? Bro, he's not even human anymore. He's just a he's just a wild monstrosity. I don't understand the details at all. Like what what what's costing causing this mutation? Oh yeah! I remember that man. What is going on with him? Did you see his eyes? Oh my god, that was so creepy. What's going on? What's going on there? Knowing the future might change the present, which might change the future. What? My head hurts. Thank God Homer is here. Thank God. This is even worse than before. How did reversing the life force make make him even stronger? I don't understand it. Yo, his mind is is down to his like his base desires. Whoa, whoa, whoa! He's remembering that timeline. He's remembering everything from that timeline. Oh no! Oh no! Yes! Yes! Oh man, the overdrive is awakening! Bro, 
Oh, he looks so cold, man! Oh, that's a Demon King right there, guys. That's a Demon King right there. This whole situation is just weird, man. It's just weird. Goddamn tentacles, yo. Yo, I don't know what's gonna happen with this black hole ability. Oh no! Oh my god, man! <laughs> He <laughs> looked like he just disintegrated half of his body! Oh man, yo. It looks like everybody's putting in some work, man! なんでこの星の人間は15歳までしか生きられないの? Now, maybe we have some a better idea about his desire to want to live. Are you trying to tell me that Jack and Joe had the same type of desires that Shiki had as a kid? Whoa, what happened to him? What made him what made him so disastrous? Meteor Breaker! He's right about that! You've lived long enough, man! Oh. Yo, man. That, yo, that was cold, yo. Oh. That was a great way to defeat Jack and Joe, it really was. Well. I guess that's the end of Drac and Joe. I had a feeling this was gonna end it within like the first half of the of the season here, but still pretty good, very satisfying. Learning a little bit more about Wise's history and that fact that uh, Drac and Joe was stealing the life force of his mother and other people really, really kind of added a lot more depth to Wise. Shiki, on the other hand, oh, really, really powerful man. Him being able to unlock his uh, his overdrive here was very, very crucial. Um, you know, I didn't expect Drac and Joe. To go into like a monstrosity in a monstrous type of form but it definitely kind of uh, up the an ante having Shiki kind of see glimpses of the other timeline where he died and saw what happened there um, it was very interesting because now we know that they can actually maybe partially access those other timelines especially in, in distressful situations but his damn overdrive is so freaking cool man he looks like a straight-up demon like a straight-up demon and like him being able to use his uh, grab 
gravity ether like that with like the black hole ability and then at the very end they're just taking down Drak and Joe. I liked learning a little bit more about Drak and Joe's history. I didn't think that they, or it would be a way that they would um make us feel sorry for him or feel bad about the way that he is and stuff. But the fact that he, he, he was part of a plan that only had kids living until 15, it makes sense why what his desire to want to live was. That kid was so much more idealistic and, and hopeful than Jack and Joe is, who just basically wants to use people for his own gain. Like, that's a big shift, guys. So I really want to know exactly what happened to, to cause that shift. But for this video, I will see you guys around. Take care and have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.